Okay, let us see work and efficiency today. Now imagine two men plus three women. They are doing the work in 15 days. So if it is six men and nine women, how many days it will take? So common logic is that, okay, number of people are increasing. So number of days will decrease. Okay, but how much? Now 2 has become 3, so it has increased 3 times. 3 has become 9, this is also increased 3 times. So, if the people have increased 3 times, then number of days will become 1 third of it. So, days will be 1 by 3 into 15, so they will do the work in 5 days. Now, let's see one more. 6 men plus 8 women are doing the work in 10 days. So, 15 men and 20 women will do it in how many days? So, now we need to see what is the ratio of increase. So, 6 by 15 is 2 by 5. Similarly, 8 by 20 is also 2 by 5. So, the ratio is now 2 by 5. Now, if you are getting confused whether you should take 2 by 5 into 10 or 5 by 2 into 10. Here we did 1 third. So, here it is 2 by 5. But if there is a confusion, if suppose you decide to do 5 by 2 into 10, then what happens? Number of days are increasing. So this cannot be happening. If number of people are increasing, number of days have to decrease. So whatever ratio you are taking, the denominator should be bigger than the numerator. So you will multiply 2 by 5 into 10. 5 ones are 5 twos are. So now the work will be done in 4 days. Okay. Okay. Now let's see when there are 3 people. Suppose A plus B are doing a work in 10 days. B plus C are doing work in 15 days. A plus C doing work in 12 days. Then A plus B plus C will require how many days? So let's use the concept of in one day. If A plus B takes 10 days to do, so in one day they will do one tenth of the work. If B plus C is taking 15 days, in one day 1 by 15th of the work. If A plus C is seeking 12 days in one day, 1 by 12th of the work. So, the work done in one day by all of them together, I adding the left side, you will get twice A plus B plus C is 1 by 10, 1 by 15, 1 by 12. So, work done by twice of A plus B plus C in one day equal to, when you solve this, 15 into 10, 12, 10 into this and then 10 into 15 and here it will be 15 into 10 into 12 so this comes out to be 450 by 1800 twice a plus b plus c okay so a plus b plus c comes out to be 1 by 8 so work done by a plus b plus c in one day is 1 by 8 so they will take 8 days to solve it now this is one method to solve it by using the concept of work done in one day. Another method is LCM. We will see another example for this method. Okay. So next thing A plus B is doing the work in 80 days. B plus C is doing in 120 days. And A plus C is doing 112 days. So B alone will do in how many days. So you have to use the concept of work is equal to efficiency into time so what is the lcm of 80 120 1120 comes out to be 1680 so efficiency of a plus b is this you have to do this lcm by the number of days taken by a plus b that is 21 similarly efficiency of b plus c will be 1680 by 120 14 and then efficiency of a plus c will be 1680 by 112 again adding both the sides the efficiency of twice of a plus b plus c will be add all this comes out to be 50 so efficiency of a plus b plus c is 25 so now you have to find what is the efficiency of b so it can be a plus b plus c minus a plus c so 25 and what is efficiency of a plus c minus 15 that is 10 
so b alone will do the work in 1680 by 10 is equal to 168 days here are the practice questions from atc previous year papers uh, try to solve them and uh, post the answers and queries in the comment section and also if you're looking out for 